Hey there, hope you had a great weekend. Welcome to The Final Wager. I'm Keith Williams. Another penultimate wager tonight. Well, at least it seems that way, and I think Natalie thought the same thing. $1,600 clue, she wagered $2,600 to get herself to $20,000 even. But there was still time for one more clue, which Gordon nabbed to get to 10 6 Two things to say about Daily Doubles late in Double Jeopardy. First of all, you can always do the Alex Jacob method. Well, Natalie, you can see the scores, and geez, Alex, don't give the math on a plate. Hey, you can see you're leading by 8,000. Uh, hmm. Hmm. Say something. Hmm. Eh, 2,600? And then drag out the answer, even if you know it really quickly. If you want to do it a little bit more mathematically, and perhaps a little bit more ethically, not my opinion, but to some viewers at home, remember that you, as the Daily Double finder, are going to have the next clue. You're going to be able to choose which value you take. So if you think there might be enough time for one clue left, then wager enough to cover the smaller of the two values remaining. So if Gordon gets this $800 clue, which you do have the choice to pick, he'll get up to $10,200, which means you're going to want to get to $20,400, which means a wager of $3,001. In the end, it was all moot. Natalie got this right and then got final right, and she wins by $53. So congratulations to her on her third game. And... Uh, well played, Gordon and Sue. And uh, we'll see if she can tie or pass Elliot Yates tomorrow. He's be shaking in his boots right now. We'll see you then on the final wager.